It was a uh, Saturday morning post um, our last trip to Coombe with the Binny. And um, we know we need to sort the brakes out like massively. So um, obviously Spike's decided that what we actually need is, is a bit more power. So he's working on losing this top mount and working one down there because obviously the brakes are ruined. So this seems the most sensible thing to do on Spike, doesn't it? Yeah, our conversation about brakes turned into let's make a front mount and completely redesign the front crash bar. But like in fairness, um, it was all a bit of a hodge up the front here because we didn't know it was going to work, did we? No. Everyone, everyone always says like the compound charge, twin charging, whatever, none of it works, so don't do it. But we've done like a good successful day with no real problems engine wise at all. Um, it seems well, all right, all it works. So let's let's play a little bit more. Let's develop it. Let's have a proper go at seeing what's going on. So plan is to remove all this shit, get rid of all the plastic. Um, get a front mount in the core rear, lose this top mount, um, lose all this stuff, put like a steel steel beam across here. Um, we can mount our charge pump in a more sensible fashion. Um, so yeah, we're just basically stripping a load of stuff off now. And um, fitting our shit yes, intercooler all we found in the shed. Top quality Toyo Sports intercooler found in the shed. We, we found two. Um, but decided that the uh, the other one was somewhat more sensible because it fitted somewhat. So, um, yeah, I suspect the video will now jump to next Saturday when, when you luck, we might have some metal here and we might even start building some stuff up. Anyway, so we've got our, uh, all our plastic front panel off. It's over there in many, many pieces. And uh, so, again, as well as... Uh, this metal bit across the front here we've we've kind of decided to just move lots and lots of stuff we're gonna redesign this pipe here to a completely different setup we're gonna move the throttle body um, from pre to post charger and put it onto the end of the inlet manifold there um, we're gonna get a slightly different um, throttle body purely because we can uh, at this point it seems sensible and this then gives us a load of extra room around where our um, charge cooler is um, so we yeah we've just convinced ourselves to do a load of things properly rather than just bodge it up and throw it together few more improvements yeah more improvements still no fucking brakes still no brakes but uh yeah joy us so yeah different intercooler lose all the horns um Having just lost all this plastic, I think it will help with our brakes, to be honest. Um, but yeah, ho-hum. So we've, um, we've modified um, the inlet, I'm trying to simplify things really. Um, we did buy um, the, a, like a slightly larger BMW throttle body, which we forced in there. We kind of thought, well, when in Rome, ain't gonna hurt, they're only like 20 quid or something. Um, We've modified the horn on the other side, which we've got a picture of, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, all the rest of it's like completely simple now. Um, so all we're doing now is we've got rid of the plastic um, piece on the front of it that holds the radiator and such like. So what we're doing is uh, making this structure here now, which should simplify the whole front end and allow us to have our front mount intercooler on there. So um, yeah, it's been like a fairly good Saturday morning to be fair. The break the break up brakes going well, isn't it? Break up is going well. Break up brakes going well. We have ordered new brakes though, in fairness. We've got some uh, some of the Brembo 275 McGann calipers coming. And we're gonna run the 330mm GP2 disc. So hopefully that'll get rid of our braking issues. But yeah, so we're gonna stick this in here now and um, get these rads mounted. So you can see here the throttle body, we've obviously moved it from pre-charger, which is where it was, and where they, all the R53s are. We've got lots of reasons for doing this. Um, one of them being like the cost of our boost pipe work mainly. Um, and there's the the second, or the, you know, the, the horn, what was round there. Um, we've got our brake take off here. Nice round boost pipe, come down there. Happy good times. Yeah. We've, uh, we've got our uh, frame on there, 
Um, stop rod mount positions are obviously now mounted properly with some box section at the top and we've just got these original fittings at the top. Um, this is just our link bar, obviously front mount ink over there, actually looks quite small but it's a bigger bigger front area than the top mount we had. Remounted the oil cooler as well over here behind this headlight. Um, so we're just really now mounting the, the charge rad just along the top here. Um, set the go, good day's work. I think we've done right, Uncle Spike. That is the, the whole front end cooling arrangement, cooling pack, front panel, completely and utterly solid and absolutely sound. Still no fucking brakes. And still no brakes, no. But I do feel that the uh, we haven't done any uh, bodging on said cheap track car. We're still not we're still not paying no money. We're still we're still it's still cheap cheap. But we do need to carefully modify the bumper now to fit. So um is that kind of a concludes what we're doing today um, it's good Saturday's work really to be honest with you um, everything's uh, set to go maybe next uh, maybe next Saturday we'll try and plumb in some of these bits and pieces we're going to make some more brackets to come out off of this main front panel we've made um, to locate um, we've got like a charge pump to go that side and some air ducts to go off to the brakes so we're gonna, we're gonna actually mount these in here like on the steelwork behind um, so that we can just, you know, move the bumper on and off. Obviously, we've got to trim some bits here to get some boost pipe work in. But yeah, that's a good day's work there. Hopefully, uh, it's, it runs and drives okay. We've had to um, reset the throttle body. Um, other than that, yeah, we're all set to go. And we've, we've got another pile of crap we've pulled off the car. So yeah, see you next week. Yeah.